hello there welcome to my channel so in today's video it is very simple you are going to look at mass messaging hack and this is what i mean you are going to send a message to a group of people but each of them will receive it individually addressing to the person so for example this message that you are seeing it said don't miss out sister fia now you can see this was a group message i sent but it has been addressed to her personally now let's go to the next person this one too was addressed to sister abija it was the same message sent at the same time this one too was addressed to angela this one was to emmanuela emmanuel kweku penel sister grace and the rest so that is what we are going to do basically you are going to send messages to a group of people at the same time now before you can do this there's a secret how you can save their names now you can see we have first name and last name so in this video you learn how to save names professionally first name and second name so that when you want to send the messages it will go and then the person's name will just be inserted in the message automatically without you sending them individually so it can be thousands of people it will address each of them according to the way you save their names so stick and stay and we will be right back with that video thanks for watching a great you are welcome back to this session so here i made mention of saving a number in a professional way so for example this number that i've put in the first name if you are using the title for a person then the software you are going to use will pick the title and the name as two names so this is what i mean let's say this one is a sister Okay, Abigail has come. Let me select Sister Abigail. Now, the software will pick the sister as the first name and Abigail as the last name. So even if you put another name here, like Brown, and the next video that I will show you, when you select last name and first name, the Brown will not show up. It is the Abigail that will show up. So if you want the Abigail Brown to show up, then don't include any title. This also depends on the person you are saving the name. If the person is an adult and you can't save the name, just roll like that. Then when you add a title let's say mrs abigail then note that when you are sending the message it is mrs abigail that will go and if you want abigail brown to go then you shouldn't precede the abigail with anything so that is a trick that you use to save the name so abigail brown then you save it so when you save it that will be all if at this number i just created it i don't know whether it exists or not so please don't call then you click on save you are good to go so that is the secret don't save a name that when you address it the person will not be okay even if it is the nickname of the person for professional messages send them please use the correct name the official names of the people and then one last thing this name when you save it it is not only going to be used on whatsapp you can also use it to send personalized mass sms messages so take me now let's move on to the last session where we are going to send a message to a group of people but in a personalized way great so like i was saying we are using the auto test up now we are going to send the message to a group but in a personalized way so let's click on this and then click on schedule we are using whatsapp so let me put in the messages here and here is the trick i want to put the pe their names here so you come to this last option here something that looks like a curly bracket then you come down here and it will tell you get the first name only so you click on it then you realize that it has inserted then let me space it go there and add the second name the reason why i'm doing this is that the app when you save the person's name like i was telling you and you say sister calendar or brother paul it will take do the two names the two words you use are on the first name it will pick the two names only as the first and last name so unless you save it as calendar then you go to the same name or the second name and say brown then that one the first name will be calendar then the second name will be brown so huge thanks for joining us for the easter celebration god bless you immensely then let me add a slogan let me add a hashtag to it so we've now set this we can add an attachment to it now let's go to the numbers i will not enter them here so click on this and i will go to phone contacts so here i will search and because i use sister as the beginning so i will just search and when it comes i will just click their name so i'm selecting those who came the good thing is that after you selected it you can delete the search and then you type in another word then let me select those who came so i think i will okay i will use this and when you are done 
one if i when you check on this mark sign here that are double it means you are selecting everything click on the top here so you can see that the way i save the name sister this then it will mean that the sister and that name will come great so now we are good to go i can either schedule this one but because i want you to see how it is i will not schedule it i will just send it right away now let me bold the name so that the person will know that this message is personalized to him or her is very very important so you put the asterisk there because we are using whatsapp then let's come down here and then say that right now we can choose a time but you can say right now and you click the mark sign here so let's see because we selected right now now you can see that it is sending the messages so these messages are being sent to those who came for the program And it is addressed to them individually. So the trick is when you are saving a number, it is completed. When you are saving a number, always make sure you save the number with the correct name. So you can see Brother Bill. Now I also sent another one here. You see, don't miss out. This was the reminder. And then this is the Thanksgiving. So it is important that whenever you are saving a name you save it with the right name of the person and this app will just do the work for you very easy and simple so that is how you send group messages but you make it in a personalized way so in this case whenever you send a message the person will reply you don't use broadcast because when you use broadcast there will be a microphone or a speaker icon here to tell them that it, it was a broadcast message so thanks for watching in the subsequent videos i also show you how you can also send a personalized sms which is group but it will be personal stay tuned if the video is helpful kindly subscribe to my channel like comment and share and if you have any question or if you have anything you want me to make a video on kindly leave that one in the comment section and i will be glad to assist you on that thanks for watching